Can I help you, Aegis? I hope so, Abbot. Our salvation is at stake. I am listening. You still have no news from Citroën Brissot. Indeed, we wait in vain, and our hopes are beginning to fade. He knew we were to meet here at the first blood spilt by the king. Mes amis, we must fear the worst. Can you think of any place he might have sought refuge? No, not at all. May I venture a speculation? By all means, Monsieur le Comte. These past few weeks, Brissot has been invariably accompanied by a young fanatic he met in Versailles. Ah, yes. The Amazon. What was her name? Mademoiselle Terroigne de Méricourt. She goes on about this grand patriotic project of hers to anyone that will listen. She wishes to raise a battalion of female combatants, ready to lay down their lives for the nation. <laughs> a curious passion, isn't it? Who knows, monsieur? Only time will tell. In any case, our proud Athena seems to have won the trust of a number of Third Estate deputies, including Monsieur Brissot. Perhaps she will have some information about him she'll be willing to share with us. But you'd have to know where to find your Amazon. It just so happens that Mademoiselle Terroigne de Méricourt holds court just a stone's throw from here. 8 Rue de Tournant. No doubt Aegis will be able to make her way there without any trouble. We need only hope that our Amazon has taken shelter there to escape the royal terror. She has gone off alone to rescue Citoyen Brissot. It's a fool's errand. I must help her at all costs. I found this on Citoyen Terrania's door. Par tous les saints, Pierre Brissot was taken to the Hôpital Saint-Louis. Why? Who knows? No one knows what's been going on there since the King closed it two years ago. After two centuries of use, the hospital buildings were in danger of collapsing, and the overcrowded, unsanitary cemeteries all around it were hardly conducive to curing the sick, not to mention the nearby Montfaucon gallows, where the king could very well make hanged men dance once again. Has he turned the hospital into a prison? It's possible. He's lost count of his enemies, but he can't kill everyone, can he? I'm afraid he has no other purpose, Abbot. He has declared war on the entire human race. Goodbye, Abbot. How's it going, everybody? Welcome back to Steel Rising. It has been a minute, at least maybe for you guys. For me, uh, it, had, it has not been, uh, but that is a story for a couple minutes from now. Um, as you can see in the opening uh, couple minutes there, showing how to access the DLC. Uh, so we are about to jump in. This is the first episode of the DLC Let's Play. Um, based on the poll that um, I pu put in the community post a little bit ago, uh, kind of a split decision. If you guys wanted to see a Let's Play only or a Let's Play and a and a walkthrough. Um, so I guess I will base that on if. Uh, if I miss a lot of things potentially, and um, then I maybe I will do a walkthrough. I have not really decided yet, uh, so we will see. Um, so as far as my story goes, uh, so November 10th comes along, and go to access the the DLC, and I can't. Um, the Let's see my let's uh, my let's play um, my let's play file was somehow got screwed up and uh, that was in um, that was on New Game Plus. Um, I had finished New Game Plus and was in Versailles. However, when I went to access it, I was in Luxembourg for some reason. Uh, and then 
when I went to access uh, the DLC through the walkthrough character, which had finished the game, uh, it loaded me straight into the credits and didn't. Uh, it's supposed to create a sep uh, special save file to, you know, transfer you back to uh, Luxembourg so you can access the DLC. So I was like, oh, that's curious. So I, I got something here. What a while. Um, this, I believe, opens later. Uh, I did get uh, brief access to this uh, early on when uh, this was in development and they accidentally, uh, I don't know, gave, gave players access to it, I guess. Um, so I do remember pieces of this. I didn't get very far. I did, I think I did die and lost uh, my essence in here because uh, I couldn't access it again. So that, I was a bit salty about that, but uh, anyway. Um, oh, got some doggos. So anyway, uh, I saw that couldn't access the DLC, so saw on Twitter that uh, the Steel uh, the Steel Rising Twitter account said uh, some players were having uh, difficulties accessing the the DLC. Some console players. What's up, buddy? Um, so they said they were looking into it, and I said, okay, well, I am probably one of the ones having a issue then. So, waiting and waiting, I keep monitoring the account, and on Thanksgiving, let's see, I think there's, oh. on Thanksgiving, they sent a message saying that they were sorry, but people who, uh, people who bought the Bastille edition, which I did, uh, and the reason I did is because you have, it comes with the DLC, uh, they said they were unable to create the save file that would allow you, once finishing the game, to access the DLC. And I did uh, post part of the story in, uh, in a community post, so I don't know how many people saw it, but uh, so... They said, uh, pretty much, you have to play through 80% of the game again to get to, uh, get past the Bastille, and in order to be able to access the DLC. So I was pretty salty about that. I was like, you know what? I am not going to do that. Uh, as much as I did enjoy this game, I am not going to do that. But then I sent out a, uh, our community post poll and you guys wanted to see the content yeah I think this is a new guy up here uh, but so honestly that it's that is uh, all the feedback I needed you guys wanted to see the content and it's all about you guys and not my um, whoa okay not my uh, bitterness with uh, spiders um, inability to uh, do things properly in their game. So it's all about my audience, it's all about you guys. So uh, you guys wanted to see the content, so here it is. So I think, um, I wanna say this, no, this can't be where I died. Um, in the, when I first had access to the DLC. No, I think it was in this building actually. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. These are new guys, new frosty guys. Um, let's see, what are those guys called? Characters, main characters. So yeah, I pretty much played through 80% of the game again uh, to get to this point. Um, and I just did the 
pretty much I just did the walkthrough character all over again because it was my favorite character. Able to, uh, I had fun with the agility build though. Uh, but the walkthrough character, I I enjoy smashing things and they die. So, <laughs> uh, let's see. Felines. Cooks, hunters. Oh, okay. So, yeah. So that is a... Yep, that's an apothecary. Okay, that's cool. Alright. Um, so yeah. Like I said, it was about episode uh, 33 of the Let's Play that... Um, I had I got access to this. I thought this was the regular game. Um, I was like, oh wow, new. No. Oh, you guys are everywhere, huh? Oh, that's cool. That's fancy. Um, so yeah, I thought it was part of the regular game. I'm playing through, and I'm like, oh, new area. This is interesting. And then quit the game, and then I went to load back I recorded an episode I went to took a break I went to load back in it's like oh you can't access this area because uh, uh, it's in development I was like oh okay well there go my there goes my anima essence I break this nope that was like I think it was like 20k or something like that I was kind of salty about that uh, can I? Oh. No, I don't, <laughs> I don't think you, you're meant to go up there. Okay. Alright, so we got some cells over here. Uh, one second. Here. The nation would do best to avoid adopting any sudden measures. Major changes would be disastrous for the colonies and the capital alike. The only way to grant slaves their freedom is through judicious reform. I agree with Monsieur Brissot. The assembly should proceed one step at a time. To begin, we must first abolish the trade. Monsieur. I doubt that our enslaved brethren share your laudable forbearance. Well said, Mon Père. The colonists are unwittingly sowing the seeds of a bloody rebellion. I predict that they will come to regret it. For my part, Monsieur le Marquis, I predict that you will not forever fault me for my restraint. I predict you will understand the sacrifice I am prepared to make, and the fight I vow to lead for the good of our cause. here okay. so yeah I I truly appreciate all the feedback and everything that I have received on the walkthrough and uh, let's play series um, all the guides and everything that have been uh, put up till this point uh, it's truly appreciated I, I am thankful for each and every one of you guys not grow on YouTube without an audience, and I truly appreciate every single one of you. Let's see what's up here. Uh, nothing. Hello? Oh, hey. Ooh. Okay. Trying to parry me, sir. I don't think so. So yeah, I think going out of this building is where I died. Oh, 
originally when I accessed the area. Way back when. So I did not get very far. But from what it looks like, uh, this area is uh, kind of extensive. Looked, uh, took a look at the trophy list as well. Um, there is a trophy for uh, beating the the boss of the area with. Um, how can I jump across? No. Uh, there is a trophy for beating the boss of the area with uh, with the new weapons that you get. What do we got over here? Oh, hello. Come down. Okay. Oh, that's interesting. Yo, what? Okay. Calm down, guys. Oh my god. Alright, if you can heal yourself, you need to... You need to fucking go. And you. Oh my god. Okay. So who's where those guys? Uh, let's see. Places. I have a feeling. I, I've seen all the. Uh, the names of the enemies, I think that was a necromancer, probably. Would make sense. Yep, necromancer. That makes sense. It looks like we can't go anywhere there. Oh. Hey, it's Mr. Smelty. Come on. Oh god. Mmm. <clears throat> None of that shit. There is a cannon guy up there. Yep. Another sandbag there. That's enough of that, sir. That is enough of that. Cast iron. Alright. Uh, we'll have to... 
try and get this. Ah! No! Oh, there we go. And check these barrels over here. You know how it is, guys. You gotta break everything. boy. Sit down. I have to read through the notes again for the DLC. Um, see how many weapons there are. I think there are five. I th actually, uh, I think I already bought one of them because it was in the boutique, um, the rail baton and shear. Um, so it's like a lightning twin blade. So obviously that would uh, that would have worked on the let's play character with the agility build. But... So we'll have to see what what other new weapons we get. Um, I believe. From what I have heard, um, we are supposed to uh, get access to that area of the Bastille that was previously unavailable. Whoa! Hey! Didn't know there were two of you. Um, the area of the Bastille that was previously unavailable that I couldn't figure out how to get to. Um, I believe we get access to that here. From what I hear, the the DLC is about uh, five hours long. So, kind of shitty. Gotta play through 80% uh, of the game to access a uh, five-hour DLC, but it is what it is. Oh, hey! How's it going? This area is like all marshy, kinda. It's like multiple ways we can go here. Um, yeah, Jesus. Um, okay. What? Where'd you come from? I don't know if I'm over-leveled for this DLC or not, but, I mean, uh, show you guys, level 40, I mean, that's where, that's where I was, uh, previously, so, okay, so, this guy jumped out over here, so we got that spot. I feel like that over there is progression, so let's check out what's over here. Anybody? Okay, that is locked. Jeez. Um, that's locked. Okay.
fuck did you just do? I think he hurt his friend. Um, that. Oh, it's always a good thing. Damn, dude. So many ways to go here, it's ridiculous. Anything over here? Ah, besides that. Does not appear so. Uh, yeah, I don't know, man. I don't know. Upper gallery. You know what? Let me go through those gardens first before I do all this. Or whatever was over here. Yeah, there was like a spot over there to go to. Or like over there, yeah. Lots of pathways. What's up? shiny there. Alright, well, this looked like progression, but I guess it is not. Alright, so... Can't do anything with that. Uh, let's check out what's over here. Jesus, man. Another gate blocked. Oh! What do you got up in here? Lightning chain. Let's see. I'd be down for that. It's probably... Yeah, it's got a uh, power scaling and agil uh, agility. A little bit of agility. It's probably pretty low um, in alchemy. Let's see. Lightning storm. Okay. Alright. I'd be down to try that out. I want to see what else we get first, though. Okay, yeah. So, this is where you would go. Looks like so I was on the, the proper path. Dude was gonna jump up, try and smack me in the face. Is there anything? Did I already come over here? Okay. Looks like up we go. Job and 
fast. You are mistaken. I am simply responding to your call. I have come to help Citoyen Brissot and take him back to his friends from Place Saint-Marie. You're too late, pretty puppet. They've just taken him to hand him over to the Count's executioners. There is no doubt about that. And I will suffer the same fate if you don't free me from this cell immediately. The key must be here somewhere. I thought I had it jingling earlier. The gas, hurry! Well, pretty sure I don't have the key for that. No, I do not. Um, yeah, I'm not even gonna go attempt to say that lady's name. Um, I know her last name is uh, probably Mary Mary Gu. Um, but the rest of it, <laughs> not even going there. All right, so I came up. That's it. Amazing, something I can unlock. No, none of that. None of that for us to go in. Okay, so key. Okay. And got another note. Okay. Anything else up in here? Do not think so. Let's let her out. Dieu soit loué. I am indebted to you, my pretty puppet. Don't celebrate too soon. You'll have to return the favor presently. But first, my name is on this bracelet. Do you know what it is? Or why it bears this inscription? I haven't the slightest idea. Ages. The mighty shield and scourge of Zeus. Of course. A shield. This was for Cagliostro's men. When he still had human accomplices. Take it. If I'm right, it will protect you from the machines that have taken over the hospital. And if you're wrong? Then we will need to reconsider our strategy. Assuming we are still of this world. Our strategy? What strategy? The one we shall use to free your friend, Brissot. Do you think he's still alive? There is no doubt about it. But compared with death, the fate the Count has in store for him is hardly preferable. Can you explain? If this wretch Cagliostro has committed the nefarious deed I think he has, we need to find three objects belonging to Citroën Brissot. They should be somewhere nearby. We have to find them at all costs. To do that, we will need to search the area with a fine-toothed comb. And you're suggesting that we do it together? I demand it, Citoyen. Time is of the essence, and I need your help. Very well. I'll search the western part of the estate. You search the other side. When we finish looking, we'll meet in front of the cemetery church. All right. That's the spirit. Let's get started right away. All right. That's bronze ingot. All right. Looks like oh, that's a necromancer over there. Is there a spot I can drop down without taking damage? There's a doggo down there too. Um, I was doing. Oh shit. I was gonna stop this at a short. Oh wait, maybe. Okay. 
Okay, so this is a little bit of a short jump. Um, because the... Vestal... The hell was the Vestal? Yeah, it's a little bit of a shortcut. That's not exactly the greatest shortcut to get back to the Vestal, but um, I think I am going to stop the video here, guys, uh, for the first video. So stay tuned. More coming at you. And we will continue on with the DLC in the next episode. Take care.